Yo, ENT, Dynamite, Gamer, here I'm going to show you a quick update of League Leaders as we hit the end of the month of May in this game. As you see, Paul Goldschmidt at an average of a 370 leading the league in average. He is dynamiting. Man, he is dynamiting. Corbin Carl, man, you ain't not catching up to him because he is red hot. As he is the only one on the top of the list on our team. Just leading. Well, Lars Nupar with a 292. If he get he if he catch fire, he can climb. He can definitely climb. Hits. I for third for hits. At bats. Okay, maybe not at bats. There's Gorman with at bats. Doubles. We got 19 doubles. Which he can climb on that too. Triples. Not really a triple team. But, well, Walker got three. Which he's ice cold. Home runs. Surprisingly, we can't hit bombs. I mean, I'm. I'm we're. We're way down here. Look at that. Walker or Gorman. I mean, they can climb too. RBIs. Clearly, we're not driving in home uh, runs. With Goldies with 37. Runs. I'm just showing you quick updates. Edmund with 11 stolen base. Bates on balls. On base percentage, Goldie is leading in that. If he can finish out the season, he's MVP. Another MVP season for him. Top 9, top 10, slugging percentage. OPS. Here you go with top 5. There we go with the pitchers. Sony Gray with 6. He's in the top 10. Milo Michaelis, surprisingly, he's in there. And then look, Sony Gray, man, still undefeated. But he been having a lot of no decision. So he's been stuck with six wins. Can't get no wins, man. We gotta get wins. Let's see, let's see. Ryan Hazley, 17, so he's three away. Tie him, if he could get there. Yeah, Sony, man, with two, three, four. 2.35234. What the heck? Then my Myers list. He's in the top 10. That's surprisingly. Okay. Home runs allowed. Matthew Libra only gave up two. Lance Lynn only gave up five. Hey. Okay. Then both of these guys only gave up six. Yeah, two shutouts. Oh, Miles. Oh, hey. Even Mass had one. Oh, there he is. He is number two with strikeout, so this is going to be a race for strikeouts for pitchers. Big games. He has two innings pitched. Surprisingly, Miles Michael is his third for innings pitch. That's surprising to me. Walks allowed. We got Steven Matz, Miles. So our pitchers pitching. They are looking at their pitch. Bad and more. Goldie can climb in the bad and more if he can catch up to him. 4.0. Oh my goodness. Man. There we go. So let's head over to our, our stats, team rankings. We're at batting average. We're gonna go do this quick. We're 15, so we need to climb on that too. At bats. 20th. 26. That's not good. Best way of run. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're 19. We can climb and run. So if we if we go on a hot streak, we can climb. We can. We just gotta start hitting, driving in runs. Make our batting average go up. Doubles were tied before, so we have been hitting a lot of extra base hits. We are. Besides triples. See you. The team rankings where the teams are at. Home runs. 
We have 58 as a team. RBIs. 19th. We can climb on that. We just gotta get, we gotta get hot. That's all. We gotta get hot. You don't wanna look at stolen bases. We. I might be skipping on some of it. Base on balls. We're ninth. So we are. We are walking. We we don't strike out a lot. We make you work. That's what we do. We make you work. Okay, I lied. Maybe we do strike out a lot. We got 428. We gotta cut that down. And we need to start slugging it. We're 17. We gotta climb. We gotta make that higher. On base percentage. We're 12th. You know, I'm, I'm shocked that we are. Just gonna skip some of these. What else? Errors. Maybe uh, we're 13th, so. And not much of errors, but. Building percentage. We're 15th. I mean, we got we do have defense on our team, but we committed too many unnecessary errors. Exactly. We're fifth in URAs, surprisingly. But three, four, five as complete games. Fifth as of Miles Steven. Shoutouts. We're leading in that. Saves. We're seventh. Long saves. I'm curious. Eight because of simulation. Hits allowed. We're fifth. Runs allowed. We're fourth. Earned runs. We're fourth. Home runs allowed. We're leading in that. So we're not giving up a lot of home runs, which is still shocking to me. Eight on balls allowed. We're leading in that. We, we we ain't walking nobody. We make we make you swing. We making you strike out. We make you strike out. Strikeouts. 17th okay maybe not maybe we're not striking a lot a lot of batters out not a lot of misses misses swings winning percentage for pitching eight okay back at the batting average so that's the league leaders in our team ranking right there and now we got see an anime not, not bad of a month for me. I mean, we can improve. But now we're going to head into game two for Philly. We won 3-2 in our last video. Then game two, then game three, I'm a sim. Then I'll probably do that for the rest of each series. Another series, like, bad teams and bad records, I'm a sim through. I mean, it's quicker to get through the long season like this, you know? It is. So, subscribe, guys, if you enjoying this. MLB the show 24 franchise of the St. Louis Cardinals let me know down in the comment like share subscribe it's dynamite let's get to it June 1st of this month and welcome into the ballpark happy to have you with us two of the best teams in the game square off it's the St. Louis Cardinals taking on the Philadelphia Phillies First pitch coming at you right after the break. game first game we we faced a lefty like the whole game was just lefty 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 and had no righties i swear this is a back to back lefty pitcher we're facing tosses to first and they get edmund for the out 
Here's a Cardinals lineup now. A guy who's been huge for them over the last month plus, Jordan Walker. And Boog, he's their team leader at home runs, so you know the pitchers on that other side, man. They took a lot of time preparing for him in that it's pregame last meeting. Month, you know, yeah. He's got a lot of pop, 15 RBIs real, in that last it's month. It's not fluky at all. Oh my he goodness. can absolutely change the outlook of a game very quickly. So watch he's out. He's driving in runs. In. Out there to center. Ah. Rojas makes the catch. That's out number two. Batting third. The first base. Here's Paul Goldschmidt. I got Goldie leading the league in batting average. Staying red hot. Yeah, a foul ball. Out in front. I thought he hung that. 19 doubles. I showed you that. He's fourth in it. And there's a foul ball. And now the lefty. Wow. Oh my goodness. We just went a one, two, three. You gotta end it. Down to the mound out there on the playing field. Don't know what it is, but I know this. He's got Yikes. good enough stuff. I'm to glad you took a pitch. And get it done on the road as well as at home. So we'll see what he's able to do in this one. Comes All right. D, that's strike two. Oh, and two. That one mm. just misses, and that is ball one. Close or that miss. There, and he's kind of wondering where it missed. You know, getting a feel for each umpire's strike zone is something that pitchers and hitters really have to think about and work on from game to game, and sometimes from at bat to at bat. Right. The punch out Got there. it. One gone here. Got it. You know, just a beautiful fastball on the inside corner. For Take a seat, my boy. Right I think the hitter saw Look it all the way. Coming from that opposite arm angle, so I got hit that inside corner and just got locked up by the hard stuff boring in on his hands. Now, the number two hitter, Johan Rojas, definitely scuffling at the dish lately. Only two hits over the last five yeah. games. Swings through that one for strike one. Oh, one Libra tour. He isn't really known as the starting pitcher that's going to get you deep into the start. It's not that he's not capable, he just hasn't proven that he can do it yet. Oh, he can do it. Next off, giving his chance for a strike. He's got such great stuff. You just don't know from start to start whether it's a potential no hitter or it's a guy that's only going to give you three or four innings. Ah, he's been giving me five, six innings. That's inside. That's but the ball. The you got to give him a chance. Kind of stuff, develop him. You expect him to get to the middle of the ball game. One out, base is empty. What does he need to do in order to get deeper into the game? Well, I'd say it's command of the secondary pitches because when you're talking about turning over the order a second and third time and guys are getting looks, you've got to be able to put a wrinkle on something, change speeds, and locate it enough so that they offer at it. Oh! Rip to third and caught! That is good. And Goodness! Top of the Phillies line up. One guy leading the way offensively for this club he right now, that ball. Kyle Schwarber. Well, they're benefiting in a big way from this guy's clutch at bats right now. Seems like there's no situation that's too big for him. Expect him to deliver if he gets a chance in this one. This guy's leading the National League in RBI. Two outs, Hi, base Harper. is empty. So digging in now for Philadelphia, Bryce Harper. MVP, MVP. 
Oh my God! I'm, I think he was looking for fastball right there. Outside the zone, but so far he hasn't been able to do that consistently. All right, got your two. What's gonna be the pitch here? What's gonna be the pitch? Curve away. And mm. just misses. Mm. Well, that's kind of what you expect in there to count. Excellent job of the hitter to have the play discipline to lay off of that pitch. And oh. another ball. Swing. as they can't make the play big knock there to keep the inning alive and an opportunity for that, that was pretty much like a bunt single Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here the gotta be kidding me leader and runs batted in this year that's in there and it's all in one put him in the third out right there Two outs. One I dare one you. Strike. In the dirt, and it's a ball and a strike as the runner holds. Here's a 1-1. One, one. And it's fouled away. That was mistaken location. Not where I wanted that pitch. The pitch. Two, two. In the dirt, blocked. You should have just stayed at first. You don't got speed like that. I think you are. Trey Turner. Okay. A former first ball, round pick. Back Just like last game. I'm gonna call it down there. The wind of the pitch. And ball, the one on misses is low. I thought it's one. One of our favorites, Jerry Hillsdale, umpiring behind home plate in this one. Pretty much by the book with his strike zone. And because he's so by the book, you'll sometimes see pitchers questioning him. They'll make a good pitch on the edge of the zone, want the strike, and not get the call. But nope. most of the time, three Jerry straight balls. Right. He's a good one. See if he gives him anything to he hit. ain't giving me nothing. Yeah. Okay, he gave me a curve. For a strike. And now three in a row. How much were you aware of the umpire scouting report or even who was going to be umpiring? Not a whole lot. I mean, there were a couple of Let's go. that weren't real good. But outside of that, you Told just you. kind of went into the game. We are walking team. Maybe a little right. Focus on the mound right there. Pretty much Top gifted four. First base with the I forgot where we were. I was right. Pass. Here's Nolan Arenado. And there's a strike as the game That's how you come out the stretch, okay. We see more and more information supplied by teams about the umpires. I've been in clubhouses where they have pictures of all four guys, nicknames, hometowns, and as well hobbies listed, just so you can kind of small talk the umpire a little bit. <laughs> That's great. Here comes a pitch. Baby, let's Second go. Drive, base hit out of the center field. Uh oh, uh oh, that's a risk. That's a risk. In there, it wasn't a risk. Two on, first and third, and no outs. Blasted, and that should have been a gapper. Weeks without seeing a ball hit 115 miles per hour, which is what's going to be a team out there. Man, he really got the bat through the zone and did not get cheated. Yeah, that ball was absolutely smoked. All right, we cannot mess this up. This is Dylan Carlson. In the air, right field. Castellanos gets under it. What a way. Yeah, I wasn't going to risk it. 
And up to hit is Wilson Contreras. This is bad. Might not oh seem my to God. Right now, but no double play. Moments, and what happens here could change everything. Come on, Wilson. I mean. First pitch and he just misses. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the All right, now, now we know how the strike zone is, I guess. Up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double play in this spot. Walker, the runner at third. Arenado at first. One gone. And that one fouled off. Didn't I say we, we cannot mess this up? Yeah, first and third, no outs. Now it's one out. On the ground to third. Yes. Dives, but it's off his glove. To first, and he yes. beats it. Everyone's safe. As Let's go. Scores. <laughs> Almost messed it up. Glad you didn't make that diving play. All right, two on, one out. Gorman. One Come on, Gorman. Stars in the win yesterday, as he had three hits. Fouled off. He was late. That that was the pitch too. Uh -uh. Everyone gets a check swing. Appeal to third. And he held back according to Rusty Valentine. Two on, one out. Hit. Up the middle. Nice. You got to be kidding me. I think I missed my location too. Here's Nicholas Castellanos. No, it's an outside pitch. But he almost took it out. That's yeah. in there. That's strike one. O2, baby, O2. Where we going with? Where we going with? Can we get him chasing? Or can we hit the corner? And that one finds its way through. Couldn't have timed it up any better than that. that Just a simple good. ground ball the other way that had eyes on uh, it. I didn't get that out far enough, did I? Travel, put the ball in play and just hope it finds a hole. Hey, sit down somewhere. Run around at first with one gone. That pitch was outside and he got a hit out of it. I'm liking what I've seen from him at the dish lately. Owns a 10 game hitting streak right ah. now, and this is where it starts to get fun. Love how vocal the umpire is today. No doubt. And the oh, hitter's mind, uh, the catcher's our mind, bet he didn't call that a strike. As to the conviction in the Be consistent, call. man. Okay, I dare you. In the dirt, but kept close. Alright, you lucky because the ball went away from him. Yeah, right there erases the chance at the inning ending double play. So good job on the bases to move up on the wild pitch. Changes the outlook of the inning. You lucky. Pretty big way. 54 speed. Tying run in scoring position here in the second game of the series. Wow. 
All right, right here, dude. You got to strike out right here. What? Spoils the two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. All right, all right. Now, this pitch, you're going to strike out. Slides for the stop to first, and that's a great nice. play for the out. Stop the goal. Uh, not a goal ahead. When stop from the runner going in to tie it. What a move. And up to the plate is JT Real Muto. To the left side, but it is well foul. All right, Matthew. Come on now. They are cranking on you. Mislocation hit your spots. Got him. Right side foul territory. Drops into the glove, and that will end the inning. One left for Philadelphia, and it remains. facing a left-handed pitcher what you tell yourself is I want to stay square to the plate and try to hit the ball yeah. over the shortstop's head that clips the corner and that's oh, off inside. the inside edge and now it's even not only if it's a good lefty hitter the against the lefty pitch. pitcher I mean, his stats showing he can, he has power against lefty and some decent contact against lefty. Just your vision at the plate sucks. Gets a piece and stays alive. That was the pitch. Throw that again. Got him looking, that's a strikeout. Been a pretty rough start to this series for him at the plate. Three strikeouts in the first game yesterday. Another one right there. They clearly got a great plan for how to deal with this guy right now. Yeah, here comes Tommy Edmund. Oh, okay. I, it out his first time. And I guess it's a strike. That misses. Ball one. And a pitch. That misses. That's ball. ball two. Two up. Headed down the line. Come on, stay there. And no one could get to it. It's a foul ball. Should have seen that coming. That was the pitch. Shouldn't have seen it coming. The wind of the pitch. That one down the line. Mm. And that's just foul. Here's the 2 2. We got a full count. All right, making you work. On the ground to the left. Lays out. That's a second time we botched it. a diamond play, dude. To eat it and they can't get the out. Well, they call that an advantage the count for a reason. You're so much more likely to get something you can handle. The second now time he botched a diamond play. So we'll see if they try to get him into motion. So, a man aboard. And stepping in for the Cardinals, Lars Newspark. That's in there. All right, take a pitch. Runner on the goal. Pitch oh, misses. Real good steal. Not in time. It's a stolen base. 
Well, with that kind of elite arm he has behind the plate, man, it's a pretty big deal when you can swipe a bag against this dude. Maybe more Good than job. anything, it prevents teams from just testing him, thinking that they can even steal the base. But right here, they successfully moved that runner up to scoring position. Good this fight. Man at second. That misses oh. the zone, and it's two and one. And oh my! Lifted in the air, center field. Rojas. Am I tagging? Moving Am I tagging? Get arm. In for the out. And there's two down. I could have made it. I should have trust my gut. Up next to the card, the first base is Paul Goldschmidt. Now it's Goldschmidt up to the plate. Three pitch strikeout last time up. Got to put up more of a fight in this one. First that offering missed. and it just missed. Wow. Well. Here's a rip to short. Consistently, if he's going to give any length to his skipper. Out to short, Edmund. I'll throw it. Lead off hitter on in the third. Batting number. The second base. This is Bryson Stock. Good defender. He's been inconsistent offensively. Ground ball right side. Goldie. A flip to the pitcher. All right. Quick two outs. That's what we like. That's what we like. So the Philly batting order turns over. Trey Turner stands in for the Phillies. Caught looking his first time up. Right through there ah. for a strike. He had a pretty good look at that pitch and not sure exactly what tied him up I'm throwing there. that again. The trigger and perhaps the best pitch he'll see in this at bat to hit. Liner and that should be extra bases. Around uh, first come on, get it two. in. And he's in with a stand-up double. Arenado, you couldn't jump up on that. And that knock bumps his hitting streak into double digits, Chris. He's hit Great. 10 straight. I yeah, just now nah, nice I just continue his hit streak. Look where that pitch was. He's doing at the plate right now just seems to be working. He literally and cracked the perfect perfect hit, and that was out of the zone. Over one so far, and that's one in ball, the dirt. No As a pitcher, you know the runner on second is ready to push things with his speed. A base hit's probably going to be a big run, so you really have to execute. Oh my it. goodness! The next pitch misses. Dow two and zero. Man on second, two down. All right, we can get out of this. I, I think we're paying us off because he's calling a strike on him. But when we're at bats, we get a we we get a a call ball. Line drive, it in, in Let's go. In. Philly strand one. They're down one nothing. You ain't clutch.
And a pitch. Got him. Swinging. He's locked in at the plate when he's using the whole field. He was out in front there. Just needs to let the ball travel a little more, and his timing will be quick on track. Good pitch for the strike. And now it is JT Real Muto. He popped out his first time. There's the strike. He's been going. That was man, the location I put there. And as a result, he's been able to keep his pitch count low, throwing the ball very well right now. Swing and that ball smashed down the line. Drops for a hit. He couldn't run it down. And that extends his hitting streak yet again. This is starting to get pretty interesting, Singy. Yeah, and the way he's going, it seems like there's no end in sight. This that was a little up, too. No pitcher wants to face right now, especially with runners on base. I mean, he's doing all the little things right, and it just seems like he's in cruise control at the plate. And here is Sosa to the plate. Ball. Check swing. No appeal. Ball one. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna pick you off, man. Kicks and fires. Ground ball left side could be two. There's one on the goal. Ending double. Double play. So they've been held scoreless through five. Ending, ending double play. What I meant to say. Bro, don't get too hyped. Oh, just a lucky hit. Mislocate. Well, it was inside, but still mislocation. It's gonna be a double play right here. Playing on the edge of the grass, looking for the sack bunt. Right through there for a strike. With the tying run on at first. Oh, they're playing in. Oh, the corners is, I should say. Grounder might be two. The underhand floor, Get it off. there's one, and that's two. Oh, a very fast developing play right there. No margin for error. Nice double play on a fast run off the line. Johan Rojas stands in for the Phillies. And that's in for a strike. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's got to be pretty proud of this outing so far. Sometimes guys cower coming into a ballpark like this, but he is attacked hitters. Pitching on the road like this is very impressive. This has been a treat to watch. Got him. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Take a seat, my boy. One out. What we like. Harper retired. That's a huge defensive play in the late stages of the game. It might not be the most challenging we've seen today, but it needs to be. Might go the distance. He might. And now it's the cleanup spot for the Phillies. Kyle's count still low. That's 69. 
There's a strike. He's controlling things out there on the mound. His energy is in a yellow. He's been in attack mode since the very start. Trying to hold a one run lead here at the bottom of the seventh. This one driven deep. Way back okay. There, and it's gone. We are tied. Okay. I take that back. You're not going a distance. One, one. Listen to these fans. This place is absolutely buzzing right now. You can feel the energy all the way up here in our broadcast booth. Ain't no way you were sitting back for an off-speed man. No way. I want to know where That's that pitch exactly was. Pitch he was I, I thought I hit my location. And hits it out of the Maybe not. Not in that camera view. Literally just smoked it. Upper deck. One down. And now the right okay, yeah, that's a mislocation. I didn't get that in enough. In there at the knees for a strike. One run across in the frame so far here in the second game of the series. On the corner for a strike. Pretty frugal guy. Through. He is very efficient with the pitch count in this one. One down, base is empty. Swing and he breaks his back. Oh. And he'll be safe at first. I didn't want to throw it because I had it in the red and I tried to cancel it. Stands in for the Phillies. Late swing fouled off. If you're a base runner, you've got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get in the scoring position. is in for a strike the two strikes may see some movement over there at first base trying to stay out of the double play right here next That's offering misses down and away way to lay off that pitch might down. need to get the bullpen going and here it comes foul ball still one and two count he's gone off speed he needs to elevate here with two strikes out of the zone one away tie game Go ahead, run stands at first. And ball. another ball. Well, this is a guy that can be frustrating for pitchers because he fouls off so many pitches and grinds out the at bat. I'm sure there are some times where pitchers would rather just give up a first pitch single than have to waste six or seven. Got him. Swing and a miss struck him out. Take a seat, my boy. JT Real Muto steps in. It's interesting he plays kind of a, a power spot defensively, but runs pretty well. So when you're looking at that position, you're not expecting someone that has maybe above average speed, but he does. Gets the call. No balls, two strikes. And I think that skill set really it. upgrades the position because when you have that kind of speed, it makes the whole team that much better. Next pitch is downstairs. What about a playing another position one, on defense, one that would require a little more range? Absolutely, and I think if push came to shove where they had to oh, make a, my, a move okay. during a game, it surprised a lot of people. You might even be able to put them was in that out? field. That wasn't out, though. The possible go-ahead run at first. All right, yeah, this is your last inning. You're at 85, almost reach a 90. And now the lefty gets a piece there. Okay. We'll do it again. Fouling everything off. Really good take, especially with two strikes. T 
two outs. Knocks that one Thought away. I had you. We'll do it again. Got you out front. Ninth pitch of the at bat due next. Bruh. Still two and two after the foul ball. Strike out already. The pitch. Spoils that one and it remains two and two. This guy is ridiculous. That's down and in. 3-2, two, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitters got to stay focused on the pitch. Edmundo Sosa to bat next. The pitch. Bruh, come on, dude. Strike out. If you get walked, he's coming out with this game. Payoff pitch. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. That's a great at bat. He saw a lot of pitches and earned a walk. So first and second with two outs. Now it's the DH, Edmundo Sosa. Here comes the skipper, and we're going to see a pitching change in this spot. Uh, only pitch, what, six and two thirds of an inning? Hey, you have a good start, man. You had a good start. That home run killed you right there. Number 62 gets the call from the pen. Number 62, Ryan Oh, God. I think this is the wrong guy to come in. Hopefully, I regret this. There's a strike. And yeah, that's oh, outside. outside. Uh. Left center. Carlson settles underneath it. Makes the grab. And the inning is over. The Phillies get one by way of the right, He did your job. I'll leave it now at 1-1. One -one. It's Major League Baseball and it's on the show. He only got three hits as a team. Phillies has the ability to really be aggressive getting around the base bats. Now a high fly ball out to left center. Carlson in pursuit. All right, we like that. First quick out. Felt such a confidence boost for a reliever to come out of ball game and get the first hitter he faces. Just makes everything slow down a little bit, and then from there can really settle in. Turner in the box now. Take strike one. All tied up here. The bottom half of the eighth inning. All right, got you too. I like that. Two pretty nasty sliders to get this hitter in an 0-2 count. If you're up there at the plate, you got to look up in the zone and spit on anything that's down. The shortstop oh. takes the ball. They try to get him to go, chase the pitch down and away, but he wouldn't bite. Oh, no. You beat no it. Play. That's an infield single. Boogie doesn't care how he does it. He just wants to get on base. And when he does, that puts him in a position to do some damage, put some pressure on the defense as well. His wheels are true. And it's still about to come. Now it's going to be Johan Rojas. Pick off move to first. And Turner's back in. I should do a pitch out. Inside corner, and that's called a strike. I might, I might do that with this next pitch. One away, tie game. Go ahead, run, stands at first. 
Turner runs. They pitch one, out. One. Still didn't work for the pitch out. Time. It's a stolen base. That was close, but Statcast shows us why he so often seems to be on the safe side of these steal attempts, Chris. Yeah, you see that plus speed, and he needed every last bit of it to swipe that bag. Such a threat on the bases. Runner edges away at second. Runner. Uh, what? Had to go again. Throw is low, and he can't make it. And that's a stolen base. Still twice. Not even close. I'd say an aggressive roll of the dice there to steal third in this spot, but they felt good. I'm gonna hit the pause down. button. Now the game plan changes a little bit at the play to get that go-ahead run home. The defense might pull the infield in. And a pitch. Bounce to third. No! Carinado. Safe! Almost made the play, but now it's a one-run ball game. Such great concentration. He was playing on definitely in on to get him. With a good swing. And there he doesn't try to do too much. We had a play at home and you messed it up, Arenado. And now here is Harper. One for three. Pulled hard, but it's a foul ball. Kittredge, 6-1 righty, 230 pounds. He traded for him earlier this year. Runner on the go. That's in for a strike. Got him. Hey, ow, a rocket of a throw from Wilson Contreras. That goes to show you stealing a base is a tough thing to do and far from a sure thing, even with big-time speed. It's not easy to catch him, but that was a great catch and throw. Quick, not rushed, and accurate. They're stealing on him twice. Bounced up the middle. Edmund throws the first. All right. And that is the inning. It's all right. We only gave him one run. One run on two base hits. No errors. Oh, crap. We're no heading into the ninth. Those a hundred miles per hour. That was a ball. Looking to get the tying run on base. One ball. Not even three. close there. One and two to count. As close as it gets. The next the All right, we'll count. And now three and two. Count it full. And a pitch. Down the line. Please drop. Castellanos on his horse. Couldn't get to it before it dropped foul. I was in the air way too long. Pitch. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. So the bullpen doing a nice job backing up the effort from their starter. Yeah, we've seen some pretty excellent pitching out of this staff so far. I blitz. I mean, they come in that was a ball. Job and get out. They've been pretty tough to get to. That was a ball for a walk right there. Lars Newtbar next up for the Cardinals. 0 for 3 with 3 flyouts. 
And fouled off. Strike two. No balls, two strikes. One down, base is empty. That's the ball. One and two. And a oh. ball evens the count. At the belt and fires. Foul ball, another 2 2 upcoming. All right, come on. And another ball. All right, let's not mess this up. Just the second batter of the inning, and on the mound, he's already thrown 13 pitches. They got him working hard out there. There we go. Good eye. Good eye. A one run lead here at the top of the diamond. and misses it's a strikeout this is definitely what a team likes to see out of their clothes who come in and just destroy all home first two batters two strikeouts see if he can strike out the side so they're down to their final out uh, the Goldie, you, you gotta be the hero here man swing and a miss as he was out front that time Trying to close out a one-run lead here in the second game of the series. They're down to the Ain't no strike. way. This guy's got such a good sinker. As a hitter, you've got to look up in the zone. If you look down, you're going to be chasing stuff in the dirt. Alvarado is just one strike away. Swing and a miss, and he got him. Ball game. Well, this turned out to be an exciting, very right. really well played game. Always feels great when you can take the series is even at home. Come on the ninth, the crowd will be behind that pitcher as he tries to get those final three outs. Everybody goes home happy with a win like this. And your final score here today 2 1. The Phillies hang on to win it for Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show. Thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chomby. Talk to you soon. He just did not show up in this game. Like ball, part, we, we only had three hits, I think. That was the same highlight game. But stop showing the same highlight. I want to see that again. Three hits. Only RBIOs from Wilson. One for three, one for four. Everybody just went 0 for. He was not hitting the ball at all. Well, we lose the series. Oh no, Goldie's going down. Since Len gave up four runs. Brandon had two home runs in this game. Oh my goodness. This was just not a good series against these guys. It was not. Arenado didn't do it. Anything Goldsmith didn't do anything. It's bad and average dropping. Carpenter had a home run. A couple of double I mean, yeah, doubles from Edmund and, and.